Hey guys, General Mechanics right here with another quick tip. This is a video I'm making um, for a couple of reasons. One of the reasons is because uh, I've seen um, a lot of uh, <clears throat> comments going on about the 2.2 liter GM on the uh, 2008 Chevy Cobalt Timing Marks video I got. And um, so I wanted to share this quick tip right here and it's marking the old timing chain. Um, this is gonna help you if you're not changing the timing chain. So, um, you know, if you got the old timing chain, uh, I'm gonna show you how to mark it and you're gonna be on time with no problem. So this is the old one I got. Um, we're doing a 2006 Chevy Malibu right there. I'm sorry for the mess, but we got a lot going on right now. Right here, we're swapping the engine in that. 11 Impala rebuilding the engine in that mountaineer right there, but this right here is the one we're doing the heads on it So we're about to put the timing chain on it and I marked it right here So I'm gonna show you I'm gonna count with you Right here. How many links you supposed to mark? So we're gonna start right here. We're gonna say This is the starting point. Okay, you mark one link and that's gonna be your starting point if you are looking at the engine, this is supposed to be your exhaust camshaft, okay? Exhaust side camshaft. In other words, the rear camshaft. So we're going to start right there, counting links, okay? We're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And you're gonna mark the number 16 so you start from the starting point that's gonna be your number one count 15 and the number 16 is gonna be painted so this is supposed to be your intake side camshaft mark so if you look at this one this is supposed to be the front camshaft looking at the engine so you got this side covered okay so let's say we leave this one alone and we go come we're gonna count from the one right after the one we marked okay so we're gonna start right there and we're gonna end up at the one i marked so let's count let's see one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, and you're going to mark the number 27. So you count from the starting point that is going to be your one right after the one count 26 links and you're gonna mark the number 27 link so looking at the uh looking at the engine this is your crankshaft sprocket so hope this uh will help you save a little money i know the chain is a little bit of money if you want to get it from the dealer and if you want to get it from uh, any auto parts it's going to be a little money too so this could be saving if you don't have to replace it the only reason i will replace it is if I got wore out uh, timing guides or messed out timing chain tensioner, something like that, you know, that will tell you to replace it. But this car only we're only doing head gaskets, so it, this car was running, it was just running hot and no problems with the timing guides or nothing like that. So remember, from there, there, the second one, the, I mean, the first one after the painted one, all the way down, that's supposed to give you the right timing on this 2.2 known variable timing this is not the vvt engine okay so this is just the base model 2.2 engine so hopefully this will give you uh any help and um like i said you know if you like my video please give it a like share subscribe for more and don't forget to leave me a comment below thank you